Amarillo Parks and Recreation, Becky Dreyer, the world famous, known all <laughs> over the Panhandle for fun. How are you? I'm doing great. Good. How are you? Well, we're glad you're here. Yeah, thank you. Uh, first of all, the first thing that Becky said is, Sheldon is in charge of the weather. Yes, he is. Independence yeah, Day. Right here. Plus one. It's a it is. Pressure no on that pressure. One. I said I would no do pressure. my best for sure because we don't want the weather to get in the way of this event because you got this Absolutely. Independence Day plus one. And, I mean, there's, I don't even know if we have enough time to get through everything because there's going to be a lot happening that day. <laughs> I think sure going right into it. Right, absolutely. So yeah, we are really excited to bring a free Independence Day event back to Amarillo. Oh wow! So it is going to be held July fifth. That's why it's Independence Day plus one. Sure. At John Stiff Park, um, we start off four thirty is when activities kick off. So we will have a radio remote, KGNC ninety seven point nine. Oh we'll be good. Doing a remote provide some music. Yeah. Uh, we will have food trucks there. So come hungry. Yes. Ten different food trucks. Ten. Will, yes. Ooh. Ten different food trucks. Okay. Uh, we will have a beer garden. Outdoor Amarillo is hosting a beer garden, so you can purchase beverages, you can purchase beer, How fun. Um, which will be a lot of fun. We have a kids area because you know what? It's what Amarillo Parks and Recreation does. We know how to make things fun for I our know, kiddos. Y so do. listen, y'all really, really do. Yeah. So we have a lot of fun events for them um, during the evening that night. Uh, five o'clock, we have what's called the Pump Parade, and it's right. not a parade in the sense that we usually think, um, but it's really <laughs> a strong man, strong woman competition. What? Yeah, so we have teams of five who will do things like tire flipping and pull a fire truck, and then we have a mud pit tug of war. So what? It will be fun to come and watch all these competitors compete against each other in their demonstration of strength. Um, then 6.30, we have Next of Kin is going to be our opening concert. Oh, they're so good. Yeah, and then Randall King is our headliner for that All night, right. and he will be Woo! at 8 o'clock. Um, following that is our firework and drone show. So we are really excited. Um, for those who've never seen a drone show, they send 200 drones up in the air, and they make a variety of pictures. Um, ours is themed, obviously, for Independence Day, but we sure. also have images that represent Amarillo and the Panhandle in really? general. So it should be a lot of fun. Um, oh. Yeah, one thing, the firework and drone show are both choreographed to music. Okay. So right. if you want to hear this, uh, the music, um, we will broadcast it from the stage, but you know, John Stiff Park is a big park. Right. So if you aren't by the stage, you can also hear it. KGNC 97.9 FM is going to broadcast the playlist. Perfect. So oh, you can log good. in the race station, you can listen from anywhere. Um, so yeah, we're really excited about this event and it should be a great day and a lot of fun for everybody. Oh my goodness. That's um, gonna be, yeah, a lot of fun for sure. And you were also talking a little bit, I mean, we were seeing a map there talking about some free parking areas and stuff like that, mm -hmm. but also let's just talk transportation because there's gonna be a lot of folks oh, coming to this. Right. Yeah. What's the best way to get in and out without, you know, causing too much congestion? Right, absolutely. So um, we do have some pre free parking lots um, on site at the park. Um, off of 45th Avenue, there is a very large parking lot, and that will open at 4 p.m. Okay. Um, we have two other parking lots on the south end, um, but if we also have bus transportation. So okay. City of Amarillo Transit will be shuttling people from Randall High School parking lot and from Amarillo High parking lot. So oh, that's if, awesome. you, if you don't want to deal with the congestion of traffic, um, you can park there, get picked up, and be brought to... Uh, the park. That's all. Yay. Yeah. That's al great. Also, um, if you need accessible parking, um, the Southwest Library parking lot is for those who have the ADA placard. Yes. And so we will continue to let people park there until it fills up. And then we have transportation by golf cart from that parking lot to the park. Oh, good. Or a, we have an accessible bus, um, again, through City of Amarillo Transit Department Yay. that can take people to the park. Awesome. So. Those are kind of your options for parking and getting to the event that day. Um, one thing I would not recommend, so if you want to see the drone show, um, you really need to be sitting in the park. Um, I know that there's a lot of retail lots off of Coulter, but you would be behind the drone show. So oh, um, you, you would be able it. to see fireworks, but you may not necessarily be able to see the drone, yeah. drone show. So. We want you to see it. Absolutely, yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Where can we go and look and, and spend some time and look at the map and look at everything? So you can go to amarilloparks.org. Um, we have the event map there. We have the activities, the flyer with all the information. Um, we're going to have some park rules posted too that you might want to refer to before you come to the event. And then also our Facebook page will have information on there as well. Woohoo! 
Yeah. Yay. Let's celebrate. <laughs> okay, let's do it and make make plans now. Get everything ready. Absolutely. And I'm talking to myself because I'm at the very last minute. Get in the water. Get in the blankets. Get in the chairs. <laughs> get them gathered up. Put them in the car. Absolutely. Alrighty. Becky, so fun. Be fun. Always yeah. good to see you. Where have you been? We haven't seen you. Oh, busy. It's summertime, right? Right. Pools and parks and right. day camps. So it's been a busy time.